everybody, it's Valerie here from the All Toy Collector channel, and today I have my PJ Masks toys, and we are going to do a Play-Doh makeover. Oh, I am so excited. I already have some great ideas for new outfits for our PJ Masks, and also for Luna Girl and Romeo. My first makeover is going to be for Catboy, and here's a clue. I made some ears, so brown ears, they kind of look like teardrops. And then a black nose. We'll place that on first. So Catboy will no longer be a cat in a minute. Oh, that was looking cool so far. And then there's a nose. Can you tell what Catboy is already? Hmm, let's add some more. Next, I just am squishing out some kind of rectangular shapes. There, and then a square. We'll place this right here. So we're making a different outfit, different PJs. There, we'll wrap that right here to make a sleeve. And then the other one right here. That is so cute. And then I'll have this as a logo right on the front of the PJs. There we go. And can you tell what Catboy turned into? Well, if you guessed Dog Boy, you are right. Isn't that awesome? I think Dog Boy <laughs> looks so cool. And what if they actually had a character like that? What do you think his special power would be? Well, now why don't we make a makeover for Owlette? Hmm, what do you think it will be? You know what? I love that Owlette can fly, so maybe we will keep her having flying powers. So let me just cut something out here. Some wings. So that will be the first clue. Then let me attach these wings to Outlet's outfit. One right here. Ooh, a little top heavy. There we go. Then another one. A second. One right here. That looks good. And then I'm going to add a center out of play foam. I don't think I need that much. So I'll tear some off. And then we'll add some more stuff here. And do you have any idea what Owlet is? She's no longer Owlet. I'll add one more thing just to give you another clue. She's going to have cute antennas. Here we go. Aww. Well, if you guess that Owlet is a beautiful butterfly, you are right. Doesn't she look great? So we're done with Catboy, who is Dogboy, and Owlet, who is, um, I don't know what you would call her. And we need Gecko. Okay, so I think I just came up with a really good idea for Gecko, and hopefully you can guess what it is. So it's going to be kind of like a costume in the front and the back. So far it's orange. And these are stripes. And some eyes. Now you might think, oh, this is easy, it's a tiger. But it's not. I'm going to fool you. There, I'm going to add a smile. And then I have over here a short little fin. And then a bigger fin over here. That was an easy giveaway. Now the back. Here's a tail. And we will add one more stripe. There we go. Can you tell what that is? It's Nemo. Isn't that so cute? So it's Nemo, Dog Boy, and our butterfly. I feel like we have some great costumes here. Now let's make an outfit for Luna Girl. She's my favorite evil villain. And since she has white hair, I'm going to add some more white to her. Some white ears first. And it's not a dog, like dog boy now. So there's the ears. A white shirt. White sleeves. And then we'll add a skirt. And you know what? Um, I don't know if you saw the PJ Masks Christmas special, 
But in that one, Luna Girl did help the PJ Masks. And for this, I'm kind of hoping that Luna Girl actually joins the PJ Masks team here. So instead of being Luna Girl, she's going to be an animal too. And so she's going to have some cute PJs, a little PJ makeover, and be a new superhero. And this is, um, actually, can you guess what it is? Might be hard to tell, but yeah, the clue was it's not a dog. It also still has spots. And if you guessed a cow, you are right. I'm making her a cute little cow costume. Oh, I think that is so adorable. You know, I don't know, Romeo just doesn't seem cool enough to have a really awesome outfit. Maybe we should just pretend we have slime on him. Or he's a Frankenstein. So I'm just gonna put his hair on him. There we go, that looks creepy and kinda like Romeo. Well everybody, I was wondering what was your favorite outfit? You know, I don't think I can decide, but you guys can write down in the comment section what you think. Also, remember to like this video and subscribe. Goodbye and have a wonderful day. Hi everybody, it's Valerie with Wyatt. And today we have our PJ Masks toys. And some of this awesome stuff over here. This is Play Foam. It is so much fun. And our PJ Masks are very hungry. You see, there's this giant plate here and a spatula and a knife. And we're going to make something for them. What should we make? A cake. Oh, a cake. Okay, well, Wyatt's going to make our PJ Masks a cake. Ooh, I wonder if it will be a birthday cake or what. Now let's go and help too. Oh, oh, she got hit a little bit by the knife. Be careful, Wyatt. She's hungry, she's gonna take a bite. No, no. Oh, okay, maybe later. Okay, so now we can do another layer to the cake, you know? Oh, I don't know what Romeo is doing. Hey, Wyatt, he's stealing the cake. What should we do? Oh, come on. <laughs> come on, oh, okay, well. Why well, it's saving the day and not getting over PJ Masks at the same time. <laughs> eat it anyway, so yeah. And now, that looks great so far. And Gecko is requesting that we have the next layer green so it looks like him. Can you do that, Wyatt? Yeah. So here's the green. I wonder what flavors these would be like. Hmm, maybe blueberry and then the green mint? Oh yeah, you got a slice. Now we are going to add another layer. Whoa, that is so big. That is cool. Maybe we should add some candles now. Now this cake is three layers and I was thinking maybe we should have it for the PJ Masks and then we can make another cake for the evil villains. Oh, that's so cute. There's one candle. That's a big candle. And then the last thing we need is a fire flame. Oh, that is a very good candle, Wyatt. Now let's make a little cake for our evil villains. Gotta move them. Yeah, we'll move them over. That looks good. Should we give them more layers or design? What do you want to do? I'm gonna make a surprise. Okay, a surprise. Okay, it looks like Wyatt is done. Five, four, three, two, one. What are you placing on top? The earth. Oh, the earth? Wow, that's perfect because Romeo wants world domination. He wants to take over the world. Oh, that's cool. And we will make a candle too. Nice orange candle with a yellow flame. Hmm, perfect. That is so cute. Well, why don't we slice up one of the cakes? <laughs> and what in the world is Catboy doing over there? That's funny. Oh boy, that's a big piece. Is that for Romeo? Yeah. That's perfect. Night Ninja gets the candle. Okay, so here we go. Here you go, Night Ninja. There we go. Ooh, that looks awesome. And then Luna Girl. Sorry, you, you just get plain. Oh, poor Luna Girl. 
Well, everybody, I was wondering, what was your favorite play foam cake? Did you like this one with the PJ masks? Or did you like the world one for the evil villains? Okay, Wyatt likes that one. I don't know, I kinda, I think I like this one more because I think the candle just is so cool. Well, thanks for watching and please remember to click like and subscribe. Goodbye and have a great day.